Hungry Bars. That should get us through the night, pup. Yeah. I'm coming back. Give me two minutes. Hi, guys. It's late. What time is it? It's 12.30 right now, and I have to wake up at... What time am I waking up? Bubby, what time are we waking up? I have to wake up by at the very latest 6 a.m. So, it's gonna be a fun one. I bet I'll get to bed at like 1.30 by the time I fall asleep. Wake up at 6. That's not that bad. Four and a half hours? That's not that bad. I mean, it's not great. But it's not like the worst I've ever done. Also, you guys, I figured out the rash situation. I was allergic to my shampoo. My mom and I figured that out together, so. I switched my shampoo back to the one that I've used for years and within the next couple weeks, I'm sure. I'll be back to normal, so. I just gotta deal with this stupid rash. It's getting better, though. It is getting better. I mean, I still have, like, bumps all over my face, but they're not as bad as they were. Progress. Camp tonight is a Planet Fitness parking lot. But we're parked next to a school bus, so... I feel like we've got company. Well, that sounds bad. I mean, like, there's other car campers, so it's not a big deal. Can you guys see all the traffic? We're, like, surrounded by it. That's okay, it is what it is. Sometimes you gotta sleep in the city, you know, and there's not much you can do about it, so. Traffic all the way around, Planet Fitness, school bus. That's the situation. And it's still really hot tonight too, like once we go to bed, I'll turn the fan on high. It's just really noisy when I'm trying to talk, so. It's 73 right now. And it's midnight 30. Like, make it make sense. It's crazy. You guys, it was so hot today during the day that I couldn't even walk blue outside. I tried to for a minute and it just didn't go well. I was suffering, he was suffering. So I actually took him to a Home Depot and I walked him there because it was air conditioned. Which I thought was kind of clever of me, to be honest. You gotta do what you gotta do, you know? Like, your dog needs exercise and you need AC, so. Home Depot it is. <laughs> Alright, well I guess we should try to crash while we can. Four and a half hours of sleep isn't a lot, so. I'm gonna watch The Office and go to bed. See you guys in a few hours, I guess. I feel like wide awake, though. You know what I mean? Like. I feel like it's one of those nights where I just, I don't want to go to bed. Like I'm excited, I want to stay awake. Tell Summer to leave us alone. Summer is not welcome anymore. Okay, New York, as it turns out, is very expensive and I ran out of money. I thought about selling a kidney, but Michael offered to get me a part-time job at corporate. Hey. <laughs> of course, now Michael knows where to reach me 16 to 18 hours a week. Hey, Michael. <laughs> Do you guys love The Office? If you don't love The Office, we can't be friends. Uh, Mr. Kiddo. Hi 
Hi guys. Good morning. How are we all doing here? <laughs> we just got done with Blue's morning walk. It was beautiful. I slept two hours last night. Ooh. So. Maybe a tad bit delirious right now. But anyway, it's time to feed Blue, so. Bon appetit. He's that good boy. There you go. Why did I only get two hours of sleep last night? Uh, good question. <laughs> I mentioned in a previous video that somebody was joining us soon and we're picking someone up from the airport and that person missed their flight this morning at like three in the morning my time. So I had to stay up and help them figure that out. But it's all good because it all got figured out. Me and my wizarding booking ticket skills, you know? You guys, I'm delirious. I honestly don't even know if I'm going to make sense. I'm just trying my best, okay? I'm trying my best to throw this video together. Um, what do I have to do? Blue is fed. I just finished Blue's morning walk. We beat the heat. It's supposed to be like 93 today. So, that's brutal. I need to move stuff around in the car. I need to fill up my tires with air because I have a low. My back left is leaking. So, I need to go to discount tire at some point in the next like week and have that hole plugged, but for now I need to add air to my tires. What else do we need to do, Bubby? Blue, you're gonna freak out. You're gonna freak. Who we're picking up as Blue's probably second favorite person in the world. Top three for sure. So, honestly, I'm a little worried he might pee all over my car because when he gets overly excited, he pees everywhere. Fun blue fact. Like, every time he sees my sister, he'll pee straight up in the air, but he he does it for anybody that he, like, loves a lot. So, he's definitely gonna lose his mind when we get to the airport, aren't ya? I just might need you to help me check blind spots. Okay. 